Hi, my name is Haley, and I am addicted to emoticons. Now, it wasn't always this way. When I was just first getting onto the internet, I uh, saw a lot of people that were using emoticons, and they were all really nice, cool, admirable people, so I started to emulate them. But as I have furthered my emoticon knowledge, I have found more and more smileys and more places to use the smileys. I'm sure all of you have noticed my expansive use of smiley faces in all of my comments and um, messages and pretty much anything I talk about on the internet I use smileys in. Some of my favorite smiley faces are this one and this one and this one and also this one, which I made. I made this one on my own, and I really haven't seen this anywhere on the internet very much, so I'm claiming this. I've also liked using this one, and uh, this one as well, so I have quite a few I like. It wasn't much of a problem, you know, just having my emoticon addiction be shown online, but now it's started to run into real life, where I've just wanted to use a smiley face in place of actual words. And you can't really walk up to someone and be like, Uh, you okay? Um, I'm just gonna go now. That doesn't really work now, does it? I am quite a grammar Nazi, so that's always been something I've kind of had. Using smiley faces and being a grammar Nazi doesn't really mix. Do you put a smiley face before or after the period? Because if you put it after the period, it looks like you have that emotion for the sentence after the intended sentence. And then it, conversely, if you put it inside the first sentence before the period, then it just looks like awkwardness and it doesn't look right. All in all, I plan to cut down on my smiley usage and I will do my best to not use as many. All right then, I will see you guys tomorrow.